Part three. Last twenty. Ah. That's a good one. That's like a bootleg of the mad balls that I uh got in solid rubber. It's bounce it's like a bouncy ball, you can bounce it. But I did it like a swirly one. Like that. Pretty cool. It's got some like glitters in the face too. Pencil topper guys, and then oh, it's, it's got a lazy eye. It kind of glued in crooked. It's funny. Oh, I popped it back in. They pop in. Let's get him on a pencil. Her, him, it, whatever they are. It's a weird little creature. Vintage skeleton keychain. I got those guys in my store if anybody wants to grab one of those. It's another one of the little stacking tiki totems. Let's see. I got another couple over here from the last first two rounds of yours. It's a different sculpt too. Pretty good. Got a few different sculpts going. I like those colors too. It's a good color combination. It's like uh, some sort of cake or something. Cake colors. The lemon meringue. Skull. These guys used to squish back in the day, but they kind of like hardened up over time. These particular ones. It's still a really cool sculpt. I just have them on my shelf. Actually, yeah. That's a cool one. He's a little greasy. Might have gotten hot or something. Whatever warehouse they came from. It's a little Thomas Jefferson vintage uh, uh, Hong Kong penny whistle. Kind of a weird little artifact. I'll keep this in its egg just because it's celluloid or something really thin. I don't want to get crushed. What'd you get here? You got a big ugly sticker. Let's grab one of those down for you. There it is. It's on clear vinyl too, so you can stick it on a window or something. I do have those in my store still, as well. Anybody wants a big sticker? Another one of these by faces. There's so many of these different monster pins, but I've gotten a few of these guys. Trade him out for one. There you go, some little mutants. <laughs> Another one of these little submarines. So as I said in the other videos, because you got a couple in the first two videos, but um, if anybody is watching and has one of these, I have instructions now up on the Monsters Booty page um, uh, in the highlights on, in the top of the page. Um, these instructions aren't good. They tell you to use baking uh, soda, which doesn't work. You want to use baking powder. want to make sure it's fresh. And then there's some other tips that I have on that highlight tell you how to make that work successfully. Takes a little bit of finessing, but they're fun once you get them going. A 
couple more little mutants. stacking tiki totem guys. Let's see, we'll put them on top of this pile up here. Very cool. That's the cherry on top of the cake color scheme that we got going, had going. Sometimes there's like a little extra plastic material on the tops of these guys. I can kind of get it off of my finger now, but you can kind of take a little exacto blade and clean them up a little bit too if you want them to stack a little tighter. But there, I got, it. I got it with my finger now. Very cool. I have these in my store if anybody wants to buy a little set of them. Some vintage Hong Kong Thule birds. Kind of rubberized version of the old cereal premiums. guy and a wrench. Little positive guy. <laughs> there he is. I like their bootlegged on troll bodies, so they got the little butt. They don't stand so well on their own, but they're happy about it. It's all right. Beetle or something. Vintage Hong Kong buggy. Ah, another totem. Let's see here. Different guy, too. I'm glad you got a different one. Very cool. Got a good totem going. Like I said, uh, these are uh, available in the store. You can get sets of four or 10 or I think up to 20 or something like that. I forget what intervals I made, but if anyone wants to get some of those guys, I got them. Oh, cool, you got another one. A different, different character, too. I think there's 10 different sculpts all together, so you're on your way. You got five of the different sculpts, which is good. This is a vintage uh, monster ring. These are probably from the 80s or 90s. I remember them when I was a kid being around, but they're cool. They're really small, so unless you're a kid or you got small little fingers, you won't be able to wear it, but you can put it on an action figure's arm or something, or just on your shelf. They're neat. Neato. You know, all right, we got two more spins left on this big old run. Something bigger. Oh, other submarine. I think I already gave you the rundown in this this part of the video, but you'll have to share some of these with your friends, or you can have them all going at the same time. Kind of cool. All right, one last spin. Let's see what you got. Another tiki totem head. Let's make the tower here. I think it's a different guy too, right? Oh no, you got this guy, in, but in a different color at least. There we are. There's the tower. Very cool. Thank you so much for playing. Thanks, guys.